Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. Um, Hydrogen Man, sorry I can't be on camera guys, but I'm gonna be showing you guys uh, a real good proper diatomaceous protocol. And I'm also gonna be sharing with you guys how to enhance the effects of diatomaceous because hydration is actually incredibly important to really enhance the effects. So let me just show you what I do here. First, actually, well, let me tell you a few of the benefits actually of diatomaceous. Diatomaceous can like improve your digestion, improve the functioning of your liver and your colon. It really helps with the detoxification uh, process of the body. Incredibly good at killing parasites and viruses. Uh, it can definitely strengthen your immune system. And you know, a lot of people say it gives you healthier skin, hair, nails, definitely stronger bones, you know, so it can protect you from like fractures and like osteoporosis, things of that nature. It can really improve your joint and ligament health. And some people even say it can help give you energy. Now, some of these things are theorized based on the ingredients in it, but some of the stuff that's actually been proven is there was actually a study done at um, Oxford uh, Journal of Poultry and Science, I think it was what it was called, and they found that diatomaceous was incredibly effective. They were using it on chickens and whatnot for controlling intestinal parasites, guys. And when they were doing it to these chickens, they were getting way less infections, no antibiotics needed. They were much healthier weight and their eggs were so much better. Diatomaceous, guys, is a really great tool, very inexpensive. I recommend doing a 90-day protocol. Some people say 30 days, uh, some people say 60. Really, I recommend a 90-day protocol the amounts are the tricky part. Um, I start with one teaspoon and do it always on an empty stomach. So like right now, here, I'll just show you like, you know, I'm gonna, this is a little teaspoon. And so I take kind of like a little heaping teaspoon. And for me, I'm gonna do a little more because I, I typically do like one heaping tablespoon. So that's about a heaping tablespoon for me. And then let me show you really how to enhance it. I'm gonna use hydrogen water. This is one of the ways that we enhance the effects. So I'm gonna pour it here if you can see it hopefully. And it just really dissolves very quickly, nicely. Do not breathe in the powder. If you ever see the dust, don't breathe it in. It's not very good for your lungs. So that's one thing, but dissolves really nicely. And this is what I typically do. I just kind of stir it like this a little bit. I'm gonna drink some of it. I only drink half because then I saw that there was still more that needed to be some sediment that needed to like really dissolve in the water. Now the last one, I stir it like that, but then I wait and then I drink it. I still saw some sediment, so I'm gonna not drink it all the way. The reason I let it stop for a moment, I'll explain in a second, is because when I drink it, I notice a few little particulates. See that black stuff in there? It's actually little, little rocks, you know, little sediment left over. And I just don't wanna drink that part. And then I just rinse out the glass. But what I do is, you know, in the morning, after basically first thing in the morning when I am drink water, I'll drink this down. And then you can, and then once you get used to doing it once a day, then you can do it at night before you go to bed, also on an empty stomach. And if you really want to do it even three times a day, I do it like I'm doing right now, which is basically before lunch on an empty stomach. But you can start with just once a day with one teaspoon. You can move it up to once a day with one tablespoon. Then you can move it up to one heaping tablespoon once a day. And then you can start working it into your routine two times a day. And Ideally, three times a day, but two times a day is okay also, guys. I just don't want, you know, I want it to be easy for people. So don't like, you know, if you're getting detox symptoms, you can back off one day if it's too much for you and then start again. Or if you're using too much, back off a little bit, use a little bit. The thing I like about diatomaceous is it can be a very easy way to detoxify. But one thing's for certain guys, it's really good for, the, for your colon health. And you gotta understand that the majority of your immune system is actually in your gut. So it's very important to keep it clean, guys. You don't want parasites, you don't want bugs in there, guys. So this is a really good way of cleaning all those out. And then the important part is this can be very dehydrating. It, it can really dry you out. So in order to really enhance it, and the effects is stay really, really hydrated and nothing does that better than hydrogen water. It stays really, really hydrating, penetrates everything like you wouldn't believe. It is the most penetrating, most hydrating, substance that I know of and really, really effective in that regard. So I really hope that this kind of helped everybody out. If it did as usual, give the video a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. Let me know that you found it helpful. And also I do recommend getting food grade diatomaceous. That's actually quite important. So beyond that guys, that's it. So you know what, maybe I'll even, uh, I'll try to find a link maybe below and for some diatomaceous. Otherwise you guys maybe have a place that you can find it. And that's it guys. 
Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time on the next video.